Hello, I'd like to share with you some thoughts about happiness. We all want to be happy. We strive for it, we dream about it, we do everything we can to be happy. And most of us have bought into the myth that happiness depends on circumstances. We believe that circumstances like good health or being in a good relationship make us happy. Of course, those circumstances are nice when they're favorable and they can make us even more happy, but they don't in and of themselves lead to happiness. The other piece of our American culture that we buy into is that purchasing things will make us happy. Owning things, buying things, um, having a lot, a lot of money. We believe these things will make us happy when in fact they don't. So I want to share with you some ideas about how to, to get that internal happiness that's independent of circumstances. All the research on happiness shows that our circumstances are only a tiny portion of our happiness quotient. And in fact, the research is showing that we have a natural set point. And that is really largely determined by our genetics. And people tend to return to their set point after high or low experiences in their lives. So you can win the lottery and feel happy at first, but within a few months, six months, your set point, your natural happiness set point will return. Likewise, you could be in a terrible car accident and your set point goes down temporarily, but within six months you're going to come back to your natural genetic set point. So one of the questions is, if your happiness depends on your set point and not so much on your circumstances, how can you raise your set point? Again, that takes us back to an internal process. Now there are some tricks to try to raise your happiness set point, and I'm going to share some of those resources in my newsletter, but I want to talk to you about one in particular, which is the idea that you choose happiness, and you have to intentionally be aware that you can choose happiness. So the shortcut that I include this time is called Daily Dose, and it's to look at your intentions in the morning, your first thoughts in the morning. Are your very first thoughts, oh, this is going to be a terrible day, um, or oh, I wish it was the weekend, or something that's not currently true, or do you think, this is going to be a great day, I am going to have joy today, I am happy today, happiness is chosen. So be very mindful and intentional about the first thoughts of your day. Once you start to realize that happiness is within your grasp, based on your response to life and on your intentional uh, way that you're going to approach life, you'll start to find happiness everywhere you look. Happiness is a matter of attention. It's what you're focusing your attention on, what you're choosing to see, the gratitude you find. Basically, the way to have everything you want is to want everything you have. That is the true path to happiness, to finding the internal anchor so that you know you don't need your circumstances to be any particular way in order to be happy. It just is your natural state of being. I wish you much happiness.